how to add order in whatsapp in shopify hello guys and welcome to this new tutorial today i am going to show you how you can add a order on whatsapp button into your shopify store it is very easy and very simple all you have to do is to follow up the tutorial from the beginning till the end and you will be good to go the first thing that you need to do is to go ahead to shopify.com then sign into your account after you have signed in into your account, you have to add the products that you are going to sell on your store. This is a very vital right here. And from this, you are going simply to the home section. Then we are going back to the online store. On the online store, we have the themes. You have here to make some adjustment to the theme. Click on customize, but before, you have to make sure that you are going to make the editing and also the modification in the current theme or the, the theme that you are going to work with. Click on customize. Simply, it will pop up the theme editor. Right here, it is very simple. We are going to click on home page. And after the home page, you are going to click on products. When you click on products, here we have some custom templates so you are going to select the default products which has all the products that are assigned to this template if you have a particular template and it is a special template you are going to select that particular template in my case i have created a custom demand for example you are going to put it right there go to click and here on the default product and after that, we are going right there to the products. Here we have a Canva template. You can go ahead and preview or change the product. For example, I get, I can get a lot of products right there. Here we have it. These are the products, for example. And then under the template, we are going to add a block. We want our, uh, add to whatsapp or order on whatsapp to be appearing right there so we are going to select here the template product information go back right there click on add block and here we have to add a custom liquid click on it and it will appear a box or an empty box in, in which we can go ahead and insert our code if not simply go ahead to custom liquid Click on OK and then go ahead and get this code. I'm going to let this code on the uh, description. Simply paste it right there. And here we have some modification that we have to do. We have here api.whatsapp.co send phone. Here we have the region code or the country code and the phone number. You have here to change those to your or specific phone number. For example, you are going to put here the number one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, zero. This is just an example. You have to put your right phone number. Then simply we are going to let this as it is. Here we have the text order on WhatsApp. We have everything set up. Simply, we are going to select that and let the code right there. Now, we are going to scroll down a little bit and we can go and see here that we have the button right there. The button now has no text. So, we are going simply right there and add a text to it. For example, order on WhatsApp like that. This is fully customizable. I'm going simply to save that. Then simply we are going to see here we have the text on the button. Simply we are going to click on the back button right there. And here we have the custom liquid. We are going to bring it right there under or above the buy button like that to let it appear right here. And as you can see, it is appearing right there. When you finish the modification, you are going simply to click on save. 
this is for the WhatsApp button. Now, everything is in order and everything is good. If you want to add this or this button or this WhatsApp button to a particular product, you have to create a template for a product. As an example, I'm going to exit this editor right there, go to the products, and here, for example, I am going to select the products that I want to add to the section or to the particular template. But first, we are going back to the online store, themes, and we are going to click on customize on the theme that we are going to work with. Here, I am going to the home page again, then products, and after that, we are going simply to click on create template. Here we have to name the template, for example, WhatsApp, WhatsApp button, or WhatsApp orders, orders like that. Create that template. You have to let it here based on the default product, for example. Click on create template, and here we have it. Now, we have to assign some products to this particular uh, template go to the products and you have made in mind the products that you are going to add to this one so simply click on that product then we are going to add it to this one let's say here that we have the product modification on go to theme template click on it and here we have the choices it will show up the templates that we have created i'm simply going to search for whatsapp orders Click on it, click on save again, right there, it will send this product directly to the WhatsApp orders. So whenever I go to the online store and themes, click on customize again, we are going to see here the category. Click on home page, products, go ahead and search for the WhatsApp orders. Here we have assigned one product or it is assigned to one product. And here we have the preview of that product that we have. If you click on change, you can go ahead and put any product and select it. But here we have only the assigned one. Right there, I am going to let this button appear right there. And here we have it. If you want to put a simple category or only WhatsApp categories, you can go ahead and create new products and make them to the selected template, which is WhatsApp orders. That was all for today's video. I hope you guys that you have enjoyed the content and hope to see you soon on the next one.